All right, mate, how you doing? Welcome back to another episode of the Wheel of Foot Tuners, episode 29. You may have noticed a few subtle changes. First of all, I'm in 60 frames. I can move about nice and quick. The game footage is also going to be in 60 frames. That's going to make it look super sharp. I've got a new microphone, which is now on the screen. A few things to get used to, but one thing still remains the same. There's a wheel, and I have to spin it before I play a game. Let's do just that. Right, here we go. Bang. We have got 29,708 coins in the bank. We're halfway through our first season in Division 2. What's the wheel going to do for us? What's the wheel going to say? Come on, wheelie. Look after us. Be good to us. It's going to be... Challenge time blue. I've got a challenge. Let's get the pot. Bing, bong, bash. Here we go. It's a FIFA challenge. It's going to make it harder to win my next game. Well, it usually does anyway. And that challenge will be... The Joey Draft. Okay, Joey's obviously my dog. Got him recently. Joey chooses a number between one and five. I have to pick that number whilst making a draft team on each draft choice. Obviously, there's five players. If he picks number three, I've always got to pick the third choice player. With the players that I then pick, I have to make the best squad possible within that draft. And if the overall squad rating of the entire team, that's the team rating and the chemistry combined, is over 180 in total, which can be hard to do, I get 10 packs. If it's between 170 and 179, I get six packs. If it's between 160 and 169, I get four packs. If it's between 150 and 159, I get two packs. If it's below 150, I get nothing. I get zero packs. It's going to be quite hard to do considering that Joey's picking the number at random and I've got to just do what I can with the squad. But let's see what Joey picks. Okay, here's Joey. He's raring to go. He's ready for his challenge. He's seen the treats. Now, we have five numbers here. One, two, three, four, five. They each represent a number you can pick in the draft mode. Above them are some of Joey's favorite snacks. Whichever number he goes to first, is the pick I have to do in the draft mode. You ready, Joey? Release the hound. Bang, where's he going? He's going to, straight to number one. Straight to number one. Okay, number one it is. That's who we'll be picking. Thank you, Joey. Okay, so as Joey picked number one, we're gonna start this draft picking number one every time. So let's enter with 300 FIFA points. Okay, I've got to pick a formation. Joey picked number one. So I'm gonna have to go with the first formation choice. Bang, four, three, one, two. Right, I've always got to go with the first one. In for Ronaldo, so I've got to go with first, number one pick. Let's get some strikers in, because he doesn't fit in that formation. Right, okay, that guy's 75 rated, that's not helpful. Let's get another uh, cam in. Who are we gonna get here? Teixeira, okay, he's the lowest rated out of all the options there. Some great options, but we have to go with Teixeira. Let's go over the striker. Come on, who's number one? Muller, okay, not bad, 86 rated. Torre, okay, yeah, yeah, that's not too bad. The other centre mid? Davis, I mean, that's terrible. In form Davis, we didn't want him. Come on. Next, Marquisio. Oh, man, we could have had some great players there. Iniesta, Modric. Got to go Marquisio. We're struggling for chemistry. 67 rating overall. Left back, going to be Iogo. Okay. Centre back, it's going to be Shawcross in form. Okay. Next, Ignashevich. Uh, Centre back in form. We've got a few in forms in this team. Right back. It's going to be Mario Gaspar in form. Okay. Goalkeeper, Enyem. Oh, look at that. We could have had record breaker check. Enyema is number one. Right. Overall rating so far is 83. Okay, which is decent. Chemistry is only 52, though. Wow. Oh, we could have had team of the year. Neymar, we've got to go with Pedro as per the rules. He's not going to fit in the formation either. Next, we've got to go with Andre. Okay, next. We've got to go with Nangolan. Next, Inform Martinez. Next, Sanchez. Okay, next. Inform Valdez. Okay, rest of the bench. Iriola. Okay, loads of Spanish right backs. Uh, Silver left midfielder. Okay, who's the last three? Come on. Berardi. No, two more. Rossi. Ugh. Last one. Come on. Isco. Right midfielder doesn't work in his formation. Right. Can we improve this? I'm going to put Valdez in goal. I'm going to put this centre back in. Bang. That puts the chemistry up nine. I'm going to put Isco in there. That helps the chemistry as well. I'm going to put Ronaldo up top. Right. Like that. Put Rossi up top here. That brings the chemistry up five. That's decent. I think that's the best we can do, guys. Let's add a manager, see if we can improve it at all. We have to go with this manager, though. We have to go with the Greek manager, even though this Quico Flores guy would sort us out. Six chemistry. This Greek guy is going to do nothing for us, but we have to go with him. So our final mark is 83 plus 69. That's going to equal 152. So as I got 152, that means I get two packs in total. That's basically the second worst I could have done. I just got two packs. If I'd got 149 or lower, I would have got nothing. So thank you, Joey, for getting me two. Hopefully I get someone good in these two packs. Okay, two packs. Here we go. Come on. First pack is going to get us 
John Stones in a duplicate. We already had John Stones. Got some silver player as well. Nothing in there to write home about. We're going to quick sell the entire pack. Forget it ever happened. Let's go for one more pack though. Come on, Joey. This one's for you, Joey. You pick number one. We got 152 rated. We've got two packs. And the second pack gets us Kamara. I think he actually had a uh, hero card at some point. Um, all right, we'll take this 2% fitness guy and we're going to quick sell everything else. Pretty disastrous challenge. That could have been a lot worse. It was actually an interesting one because it was a FIFA challenge in the blue pot. But it wasn't actually something that affected my next game as such because it affected another part of FIFA, which was the draft mode. So now we can play the game. We're not using anyone from those packs because we didn't get anyone good. We just need to win it. Come on. Right, I'm going to use my BPL squad for the first game of this episode. We've got a second inform Shane Long and Diego Costa continuing their Strike Force partnership. Danny Ings on the bench. Willian on the bench, ready to make his debut. Let's get three points. Okay, let's take a look at my opponent's team. For FC, he's got a false nine formation. Siri R base, Quadrado, Felipe Anderson, Pjanic, Nangolan, Marquisio, Pereira. Right, you are, sir. Oh, no, he's through now. Quadrado. Come on, Azpilicueta, you've got a lot of running to do. Get back from me if you can. Oh, he's laid it inside. He's missed it. Get in. Diego Costa win this. Bang. That's lovely. Ramsey to Diego Costa with a 1-2. Ramsey back to him. Get it back. Ramsey. This is good, Aaron Ramsey. Cut in. Cut in. Pull it back in. Oh, what a waste. Uh-oh. He's running at me. He's onside. And he's 1-0 up. And it all came from me giving the ball away unnecessarily. Can't afford to do that in this division. Got to be now for this half. Come on. Ramsey, down the line to Diego Costa. He can get away from Sandro easily. He's got the strength on him. Diego Costa puts it in front of himself. Diego goes back inside. Great play. Ref, penalty please. Penalty please. Fellaini, play it. Yes, this is good. Play it. Bang. Diego Costa, you're through. Diego, keep running, Diego. Keep running, Diego. Ref, come on, man. Fellaini, pull it back to someone if you can. Oh, penalty. He's gone to ground in the box, ref. 78th minute, we're going to make some changes. Change into a 4 triple 2 formation. Bang. And we're going to get Ramsey off for uh, Willian. He's going to come on on the right-hand side. And Danny Ings is going to come on for Shane Long. Come on, Danny Ings. Oh, no. He's going to go 2-0 up here. He really should have. He's just keeping it in the corner, playing it short. It's just so boring to watch. He's not skipping any replays. This guy must be really struggling for points in this division if he's having to work this hard to get a win. There's a final whistle. I mean, that guy played like an absolute mug, but I should never have given him the goal in the first place. I put myself in that position. I've lost the game. Couldn't really afford to lose. Got to win the next one if I want to try and get to Division 1 this season. So with four games left, I'm on nine points. I need nine points to go up. I need to win three of my last four. But before we play my second game of the episode, we need to spin the wheel again. Let's do it. Bang. Okay, we have got 32,241 coins in the bank. Uh, last time out, we span. We got the blue challenge time here. Right now, I'd love a buy any player, maybe a buy an inform, maybe open 10 packs. But what is the wheel going to give us? It's going to be open five packs. Okay, we can do that. Let's open them. Pack number one is going to give us centre mid from Chile Pizarro. Not interested in him. I'll take Krauts just for the pure bants of it. And I'll quick sell everyone else. Pack number two is going to give us another non-rare, Papa. The left back from Argentina. Don't want any of them. See you later. Come on, packs. Please improve. Here we go. Pack number three is going to be... Oh, hello. Levesi? Oh, it's going to be Piatti. All right. Maybe an option for my La Liga squad. I've got Conor Planka, but we'll take Piatti. Quick sell the rest. Pack number four. What's in store? Come on. Come on. Come on. No, no, no. Another left mid. I'll actually take Mignane. I don't actually mind him as a player. I'll take him. I'll take all three of them. I'll take the fitness cards here and I'll quick sell the rest. Okay, final pack. Come on, please give me a game changer. Someone massive. Someone that's going to make me feel very good about myself. Who's it going to be? Bang! That's not what I'm talking about. Berezutsky. No. Not interested. Foster. Larson. I'll take this 15% head guy and I'll quick sell the rest. That was not good. Let's move on. Let's play another game. You guys know when I need a win, there's only one team I go to and it's my Serie A squad. Salah is the king of bloody Egypt. Four goals, three assists in seven games, but he's added so much more than that. Baka is the joint second top goal scorer. Ten goals, five assists in nine games. Jovino's been good. Pjanic has been good. Perisic has been good. Even though I don't really want to change this team too much because it's been so good, I am going to bring Barzagli in for his debut. In for De Vries there. So nice centre-back partnership with Kastan. Lichstein is not going to get his debut, nor is Jovetic just yet. But I'm confident this team can get me a win. Let's go. Let's get three points. Put us back in his promotion campaign potential. Okay, my opponent is Real Kekarelli. Cesarelli, I don't know. Storage. Diego Costa. Eriksson. Matic. 
Interesting, a lot of CDMs in there. Yaya Torre, Ramirez, Baines, Otamendi, Thiago Silva and Aurier, PSG connection, and Courtois. Clear it out. Clear it out. No, off the line. Wow, not a great start to the game. Let's just get rid of it. That'll do. Great ball, actually, for Salah, who can run with this. Salah, keep going, Salah. Take it away from him, Salah. Look at this guy go. Such a danger. Salah, keep going. That's what, look at, I mean, even though, oh, yes, he's got it back. Salah, he's got it back. Put it in. Oh, it's, oh, put it in. Yes. I mean, how many times can I sing the praises of Salah? That was a nothing move. I just cleared the ball from my box. Salah picked it up in my half, ran with it, lost it, got it back again, somehow put the ball into the box. I'm not even sure who put the ball in the back of the net at the end. Was it was it Pjanic? I don't know. I think it was Pjanic or Perisic, maybe. All I know is that Salah is a hero. It was Perisic. Come on, boys. Abate, down the line, bang for Baka. Baka, look inside for Salah. Play it in, Salah, first touch, not great. Comes out to Pjanic, though. He can bang them. Pjanic hits it. Ooh. Salah, bang to the edge for Javinio. Javinio, run with it into the box. Javinio, that's great. Triple tap it in. Bang! Oh my god, how's that not gone in? Oh no, he could be through here with Sturridge. Castan's not going to win that race. He's going to score. What a save! Come on, Handanovic. Javinio, run with it. Javinio, play it. Backer. Nice from Backer to Javinio. Javinio, bang for Perisic. He's already got one goal. Can he get a second or is he going to set one up? Bang! Oh my god, I don't know how that ball got through. But we just seem to make our own luck in this Serie A squad. Baka gets another goal. That's his 11th goal, I think, in 10 games now. I mean, great ball from Perisic, to be fair. And the finish, he didn't really have to hit it that well to go in from that distance. Well done, Baka. Oh, that's a great football. That's great football. Oh my god, Handanovic does it again. He keeps saving things. Salah cuts inside. Here he is, Salah. Still going, Salah. Bang it in, Salah. Oh, it's going to fall to someone. Oh, hit it again. 3-0, got to be. Oh, how have we not made that 3-0, boys? I hope we don't live to regret that. I really do. No goals, boys. No goals. No goals. Good save. Close it down. Okay, they've got one back. God, I really hope we do not throw this game away because we should be winning it. Blow the whistle, please, ref. Please blow it. I hate this. I hate this so much. No. No. What a tackle. Yes. There's the final whistle. Come on. We had to work hard to keep it, but we did get the win. Perisic gets man of the match. He got a goal, as did Baka. Assist for Perisic. They didn't give Salah that first assist, but we all know he made it. There is a kind of un, you know, quantifiable value Salah brings to the game. He really does. And judging by their form in the last few episodes, I honestly feel if I just use the Serie A squad from here until the end, I would win Division 1 the quickest way possible because I always win with them. But I like to mix it up. I don't have to mix it up, but I like to use the different squads. So we will keep mixing it up. We only need two more wins for the next three games to get promotion to Division 1 though. But before we play my final game in the episode, we need to spin the wheel again. Let's do it. Bang. We have got 37,456 coins in the bank. It's a nice bit of coinage. At this stage, I'd love buy a new player. Just there, in the pink section, please, Mr. Wheel. Make it so, land in that region. Come on. What's it gonna be? Oh, go on, go on. He's only bloody done it. Buy any player, 37,000. Let's do some research. Okay, I've managed to pick up Angel Di Maria. That's who I've gone for. I picked him up for about 27,000 coins, was it? 26,250 he cost me, to be precise. He's going to slot in nicely to my league, our uh, French squad. Okay, so here is my French squad. Don't forget, we've got Inform Ben Yedder recently. He got an assist on his debut. Generally, it's pretty dangerous. Look at those stats. Di Maria in behind him, making his debut now. I think we can get a win with these boys. I think we can push closer to promotion to Division 1. Come on. Okay, my opponent is Surrey FC. He's got Aguero and Remy, Yaya and Rooney in the middle, Walcott, Depay, Baines, Company, Otamendi, Walker and Begovic. No, that's a terrible defensive touch. It's a joke. What a save from Ruffier, though. Wow, how's he got through there? I mean, that is just shambolic defending from me. Walcott has scored. There's no excuses. I don't know how I've let him do that. Great tackle from Perrin. Perrin runs out the back with it. Bang. Plays it to Ben Yedder. Ben Yedder over the top. Bang. For Di Maria on his debut. Angel. What is that, mate? Get it on your left peg next time. What are these defensive touches? I'm not being funny, but what has he done there? He's about to score a second goal. I don't understand it. First goal, I'll take the blame for. Should have tackled him. That goal is nothing to do with me. Very frustrating first half. I mean, defensive errors from me. Defensive errors from the game. I've had more possession. Same amount of shots, just less on target. I think it should be a draw right now, and I think we can turn this round. Come on. Verratti running with the ball. Keep going, Verratti. Keep going. Play it to Pastore. Pastore hit it. Pastore bangs it. It's a great save. Guero plays it through to Remy. It's going to be three. 
Should have been three. It is going to be three. What sort of save is that? I've got no chance this game. If my defending players aren't going to even try, I mean, I've got no chance. Verratti. Bang. Di Maria. Through ball. Go on. Fakir. Get there. Put it... Oh, man. We're getting nothing. We're getting nothing. Put it back to Benimo. Oh, how we still got this ball? I don't know. Ben Yedda. Oh, Pastore. Oh, Pastore. He's lovely. On the ball. Bang. Oh, okay. We did score a goal. Nice. And it's actually Di Maria on his debut. Great play from Pastore in the build-up. It's 72nd minute. It's 3-1. Have we got time to rescue something from this game? Probably not, but we can try our best. Good finish from Angel on his debut. Now, he's going to get a fourth goal here. Easy. Oh, we actually saved one. There's the final whistle. You know what? At least we showed some kind of fight back, but luck was against us that game. And now it's definitely going to be an uphill battle to get promotion to Division 1. Di Maria got an 8.1 in his debut, but their goalkeeper, Begovic, got a 9.2. Look at that. We had double their shots. Much more possession. No luck. So, with two games remaining, we have to get six points. That means only two wins will do. That means first game of next episode, I'm going to have to use my Serie A squad, hopefully get a win, and then try and pull something out of the bag, maybe with my Bundesliga squad. It's still possible. I'm not writing it off yet, but it may be that we have to spend another season in Division 2. Anyway, guys, that is it for this episode of The Wheel of Fortune. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, please drop a like on the video, subscribe for more. I'll see you next time. Until then, don't go changing.